cancel the whole um, training. Uh, but you can see Swami's Leela that um, at that time I happened to be uh, the secretary to the Minister of Foreign Affairs and it was very strange, Swami has always been saying you go into politics, uh, which is very unusual. He will tell other people, don't, don't, go, wrong. <laughs> don't go into politics, you see. But uh, with me there was an exception. He has encouraged me to play politics. So I did, and um, I had that position at that time. Were you in Parliament? Yes, I was in Parliament. I was a member of Parliament. That's why I, was, I had that position of Secretary to the Minister of Foreign Affairs. Uh, it's part of the political job. Um, so I went to the Saudi Arabian Embassy, and being Secretary to the Minister of Foreign Affairs, uh, if I ask for visa, they will give, okay? Um, and they did give. They gave me visas to go. Um, myself and Dr. Judo uh, were allowed to go, okay? Um, so we went. We went to Saudi Arabia. And uh, the first meeting we had with the authorities, they warned us that we're not allowed to talk about values. We're not allowed to talk about uh, religion. We cannot touch Islam. You cannot bring Hinduism or Buddhism or any other religion. I believe you were given a very thick book of don'ts. Yes, they, they send that earlier on. Okay, But uh, at that meeting, they didn't give us an, another book uh, because we already received it. Okay. So um, um, I said yes. Okay, we'll we'll try to abide by by the rules, and so we started that training the following day, and I was very scientific. Okay, uh, I used science uh, mostly to bring the values um, that is already in science, and um, didn't give one example so the audiences can remember this. Um, well, I, I started to talk about, um, for example, information technology. Okay? In information technology, uh, and I gave the example of the computer, uh, you put in signal uh, in there, you, you type something out, then uh, immediately the computer will search for similar information uh, from the memory compare with what we have put in. If there's already some program there, it will recognize what we have put in. Then it will work on it and information will appear in, on, on the monitor. Okay? But if there's no information available, then, uh, then the computer will say, we don't recognize that, what is this, what are you putting in, and so on. See, so. It's the same with ourselves. When we see something, okay, it's only um, a form of electromagnetic energy that enters our eyes. In order to recognize what we see, we have to use the same technology. That is, we have to go and search for something in our memory compare with what we have received. Okay. Then we can interpret what we have received and then we understand. This is information technology that is working right inside ourselves. And uh, so I continue to explain in that way. Uh, for example, when we listen to something, it's only vibration of air. So if somebody swears at us, why should we get upset? Because it's only vibration of oxygen, uh, molecules of oxygen, molecules of nitrogen, molecules of carbon dioxide. Uh, there's nothing to it. So when people uh, abuse us, say something bad at us, from now on we just smile. We say it's only vibration of air. So there's no more garbage in, garbage out. That's right. Um, what Then I explain, of course, that what happens is that when we receive information through the eyes, through the ears, through the five senses, what we do is to go and retrieve data from our memory, 
So what we have stored in the past will affect our interpretation of the message. So if we watch uh, a lot of um, negativity on television, uh, people killing one another, fighting and quarrel, quarreling, all this will be stored in our memory. Which Swami calls telepoison. Yes. So and also the memory is vasanas, isn't it, from your previous births? Well, uh, I don't go into that uh, okay. in Saudi Arabia. Of course, of course. That There's will no get, get me into difficulty. <laughs> Head decapitation, but I explain say. that whatever we receive from outside, we store in our memory. And therefore, when we receive something new, we also retrieve from the old memory and we interpret it. Okay? So if we've seen a lot of violence in the past, then violence will come out and we'll interpret this in a violent way.